Hello, this is a look at the Bark Rollers Planetary Alignment Watch video for August 16, 17 and 18, 2011. On this date the Bark Roller is looking at four planetary alignments. The first one is between Earth, Mercury, the Sun and Venus. The next alignment is between Saturn, Venus and Mars. The next alignment is between Mars, Jupiter and Uranus. And the next alignment is between Mars, Mercury and Pluto. Now as I've said before about these alignments, you cannot make alignments between planets on charts that are not drawn to scale. Looking at this image we can see that the planets are actually quite large. We see Mercury here next to the Sun, it's almost touching the Sun in fact. We see how close the, the Earth is. The distances in our solar system are vast and although this very good tool is representative and it's, it's very useful to give us an indication of what the solar system looks like, it really doesn't give us any indication of the vast distances and the scale in our solar system. This view is, is set to a default setting. We can change the settings here. In normal default view, the planet distances are set to 60-40. That's 60% schematic, 40% true. The planet sizes are set to 65% schematic and 35% true. Notice what happens when I change the setting for the distances between the planets or that is the orbit sizes. Now I've changed the wrong one. Let's try that one. Okay. You see that the planets are moving in and out, backwards and forwards. You see that the orbits are changing. So if we shift the orbits all the way down to the left or 100% uh, true in, in the mix between true versus schematic, we see that the, the orbits have changed significantly from where they were before. Here we see an alignment between Saturn, Mercury and Uranus, but when we change the orbit setting we notice that that alignment is no longer there. Okay, we're going to check the other alignments that the bark roller has listed for this date. The other thing that I need to do is change the planet size because once again these are not to scale. If I shift the slider all the way to the left, well we can't see the planets anymore. In fact you'd need a microscope to see them on, on this scale. But what I can do is turn the, the labels back on so that we can see the position of the planets where they are. Okay. Now the first alignment that the bark roller showed was between Earth, Mercury, Sun and Venus. On this date that alignment is actually correct. Now we're going to look at Mars, Jupiter and Uranus. Okay, here's Mars, here's Jupiter, here's Uranus. As you can see they are not aligned. Let's zoom in a little bit. Okay, now this is a 3D model so we can move it around. As you can see, this alignment does not take place. The next alignment was between Mars, Venus and Saturn. So here's Mars and Venus, Mars, Venus, Saturn. And the last alignment was between Mars, Mercury and Pluto. And once again, we can see that these three planets are not aligned. So we can't really make earthquake predictions based on planetary alignments that don't exist. Thank you for watching.